Hello, hello everyone. So if you've been here before, welcome back. If you are brand new to my channel, welcome, welcome. Um, as you guys saw in the previous video, I said that I was going to start budgeting again and here we are. So we are going to try to make this as quickly as possible. I wanted to go over a couple things, show you the binders, which I did before, but I did get the inserts um, and then do a little stuffing, okay? So the first thing was set up binders. And I'm going to check that off because I did that off camera kind of. But I'm going to go over the, the inserts. Hopefully you guys can see this okay and can hear me okay. Um, I don't know if you remember a year ago when I had this set up. Groceries, gas, and household was in my um, wallet. And it will stay in my wallet. I just don't have my wallet down here to show you guys. And then moving on, I have wipes and diapers for my daughter. Which, you know, we're starting off at zero. Everything is at zero right now. Um, and that's that binder. And then this binder is going to have challenges, which I'll go over in a second. And I'm going to try to do like one at a time so I won't fail or maybe two at a time. But right now it's not labeled because I haven't started any of them yet. Vacation and travel. And that is it, okay? So that is it for the binders. We're gonna start, let's first start counting how much we have here, okay? Because we're gonna start this off strong. I need to start the 100 envelope challenge so by the end of the year, I can put a lot of this money towards debt, okay? So, oh, by the way, look how nice this old $20 looks. And it's crispy. So I'm probably gonna put this in, in like something that I'm not going to use at the moment, maybe like debt or... Maybe in the in the three six one three six month ahead because I won't have to use it, but it's so nice. Okay. Yeah. So we have one hundred and fifty three dollars to work with, and I'm gonna say that majority is going to start off in this hundred dollar challenge. But um, we're gonna put this here. I don't even need to separate it that much, but we're going to put that there. And let's see. So I made it. I think you guys remember these from last year. And if you don't, um, I have made these little cards and I had numbered them. So I think we are going to grab, like I said, majority of this money is going to go towards um, the challenge. Okay. So we are going to do... Hmm. Let's see. Let's start with maybe a five. Or let, let me grab some. All right. I couldn't find the marker. So we're just going to grab one of my kids um, crayons. So we're going to do five. All right. So. We marked off one, two, three, four, five, six numbers. Let's see how much we have here. So we got 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 81. I think we're gonna leave it like that. So I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab those numbers and then wrap this all together. I was getting ready to put this up and I noticed that I didn't add the two dollars for the seven so I just wanted to clarify that so we have I'm gonna actually we did six numbers to start off today and I think that's actually pretty good so six numbers we have plenty more to go so this will be in and out of the videos but I definitely wanted to start it because I know that it is going to help me so let me clear this out and I'll be right back with right, the rest so of the video. We did start over um, the 100 envelope challenge. Now the next thing is go over the challenge book. So you guys, I found this challenge book on Amazon and I will link it down below for you guys. It is 2024 Ultimate Money Challenge Book and it's got numerous amount of pages to where it's got 30 day challenges, 60 day challenges, um, 30, 60. It's got... 26 weeks, 52, various types of stuff. And you can pick and choose. 
what it is that there is plenty that we can do here. So I'll probably just choose one before the video is over so we can um, do one maybe with some dice or something. But that is that. So I will link that down below if you want to take a look at it. Also, these were the things that I was waiting for that I put in the binder. I will link this down below as well. I think this was like eight or nine bucks and it has plenty of them. It has 90 sheets. So I will link this down below as well. Um, go over travel budget and cash app. So I have a out of the country travel that I'm doing and I want to show you guys this. So for this trip, I need approximately $2,500 just for the trip alone. And out of the money that I'm making, I'm taking 10% off and putting it into the saving through the whole cash app app. That way I don't um, mess up that money. Now, because I am going to be doing it with Cash App, under the travel slash vacation tab that I have, I'm going to be using prop money more than likely. So under this tab here, at least for this um, for this trip, I'm going to be using prop money because it's going to be under Cash App. Eventually, I'll have real money here that's going to go to the bank. But for this particular one, it's going to be prop money. So I'm going to stuff it with the amount and I'll show you guys that in a minute but I wanted to show you guys that now it says I am grateful for new beginnings and the quote of the day which I saw and it ties in perfectly with what's going on if you fail never give up because fail means first attempt in learning all right so if you guys remember um or not but I had I hadn't had chance to make any fancy more than a hundred dollar prop money so what I did was the ones that were going to stay hundred just have my YouTube name on it, La Chesca, which I had a couple of. And then I had made some that were 500. And I had made a couple that were 1,000. And then I had made a couple that were 5,000. And I was looking forward to using these. And, you know, my budget didn't go as planned. But because I'm going to use prop money for the travel that I have coming up right now, I'm actually going to go ahead and stuff it because as you guys saw, I already have $100 in there in a matter of a couple days. So we're going to start, sorry, 175 cents. I'm not gonna worry about the 75 cents to stuff in here, but I'm going to go ahead and add 100 prop money. And this is how we're gonna start. You guys bear with me. I haven't done this in a long, long time. So, all right. So the first stuffing is here. And like I said, this is prop money. And I'm going to put the rest back here. Back where it was. Now we have a couple of, let's see, we have 40, 50, 60, one, two, three, four, five. Hmm, we got $65. I definitely want to go ahead and put some into these categories, um, especially the three to six months, or one to six months, actually. I'm going to go ahead and add, um, let's just do that crispy 20 for now. So we're going to start it off with 20. And then we're going to do, my main priority right now is debt. So we're going to stuff as much as we can. We're going to do another 20 in debt. We did vacation. So we're gonna put this aside for just a second. Let's look at this underbinder to see if, excuse my reach you guys, um, see if we could do a little bit of something in here. Let's do 10 in emergency fund. I am way off camera. I am so sorry. So we did 10 in emergency fund, you guys. It's been so long that I haven't done this that I need to 
get back in the groove of things and get my setup together. But so we did emergency fund, we did debt, and we did the three to six months. This single dollar, I'm probably just going to go ahead and add to the 100 envelope challenge and put it as number one. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I'm just going to color this while I talk to you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like I said, we're starting off from actually failing last year and it wasn't a complete fail in my opinion. I just couldn't continue doing it um, because we did have situations come up and we had to use the money that we had put into the binders to take care of those situations. Um, but like I said, here I am. We started the binders. We stuffed some of the uh, sections there. And we definitely started strong with six envelopes. Well, now seven with this $1 um, into the 100 envelope challenge. And so far, we're doing good on the travel um, portion. Now, my trip is in June. So hopefully, I will have the 2500 that I need in there. And you guys will see this as, you know, I continue on stuffing. So I hope you guys have an amazing day whenever you're watching this. Please, if you have not subscribed, please do so. Like, comment. If you are doing your 2024 challenge or your budgeting journey, please let me know how it's going so far. I know we're still in January. Um, so we, you know, we may be starting off really strong. So hopefully we can continue on going. And like I said, I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.